So today I want to talk about Law DLC. As you guys know, Law is the last DLC character coming into One Piece World Seekers. Obviously, we're pretty sure we all know that already. But you guys know, with, with characters being added, they have specials or ultimates or awakening. And today I'm going to give my thoughts. These are not coming. Actually, no, I know what? I 100%, I 100% believe these are the ultimates that are going to come. Or specials, whatever you guys want to call them. Or ultimate techniques or whatever. They're, they're gonna come into the game when you play as law. We're gonna get right into it. So first one, first one is room. If you guys do not know what room is, room is basically a shit when law creates like a little, like a little bubble. And when you're in the, when you're, when he, you're in the bubble, you're under law's control. Law can legit do anything to you inside that bubble, and you're screwed. The only way for you to escape room is just to get out of the bubble, and that's it, kind of. But yeah, that's what I believe is gonna come into the game. Obviously, his room ability because. Room is like one of Law's main things in the game and in the anime too because that's kind of like the way Law does his combos, combos, the way he fights and everything with the ability Room. So that's the first one I think that's going to come into the game. Oh, before we go any further, as you guys know, I think he, the, Law's going to have like four or five ultimates because I think like in every character has like five or four ultimates. Next one is called Shamble. Sh Shamble? I don't know. You guys understand. Sh what's, what that is, let's say you're in front of an enemy. And then there's like a there's like a rock behind the enemy. With when you're inside the room, because this as I said before, lost lost techniques always need to be. They require room. They require room for it to work. And I was saying there's a rock behind you, and then you use shamble. I think that's what they're called. Shamble. I don't. And law basically teleports behind the enemy, and then yeah, you can strike. That's the second one I believe. So it's basically it's basically like a little teleportation shit. And the third one, two more left by the way. The third one is gonna be called injection. Injection. I think so. It's basically when Law puts a sword at you and he targets at you, has like a little radar shit. He targets at you and then he fucking dashes at you and then he strikes you in the heart or not in the heart or in the chest somewhere. But that's what's gonna be the uh, third one I said. Yes, yeah, it's gonna be the third one. And the next one is called Am. Before anybody comes after me, I, I remember the word amputation. That's what it's called. I think. But I'll try to put up a. I'll try to put up the picture of the name. I'm trying. I'm trying to get through the name. So if you guys do not know what that is, what that move is basically is when Law is able to cut, cut, no, not cut his enemies in half. I think. No, I think it is. What that move is is basically let's say you're, you're, let's say you, the enemies are in the room because they ha obviously they have to be in the room for it to work. You press whatever button on the controller. You, you cut the enemies in half. Their body parts, you know, go in half, and you know they, they go flying in your room as you control them. That's what, it, that's what it kind of is. So this is the second one. It's called Tat. That's what it's called, tat. But I think what that is, is that I think like it kind of like it kind of. So the first one is basically when Law, it cuts his enemies. You can cut the enemies into half. And I guess this one, that though, I, th I think that's what it's called. It basically, like you know, he controls them and you know, he's able like you know to push them or you know pull them away or whatever at will with his control. I feel like that's what it. That's what that does. I'm not sure if you want to put that in with like a. If you want to put that separated, or you want to put it with the car, with the, with the. So if you guys understand what I'm trying to say, I think amputation and tack like work together. Like it's like a little combo shit you have to like do together. That's what I think it is. Let me know if you guys think the same. Or Law's gonna have this is this is my final thing. I think Law's gonna have something called Dagio knife. If you guys do not know what that is, I'll play. I'll show like a little clip of it. And I can't show the clip because I get copyrighted, but I'll show like a little like a little picture of it. So it's basically when Law cuts his enemies into half. So I think what this one Dajio knife does, it basically cuts the enemy, it, it cuts the enemies into half. But you don't need like room to use it, because as you know with law, you have to use room for everything. But it looks like with Dajio knife, you don't need room to use anything. So let me know if I'm wrong down below. I really appreciate that. And there's one more. I forgot, I forgot to mention. So the last one is called Gammon Knife. You guys do not know what Gammon Knife is. It's basically when Law has like this little like 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 this little green like stick. No, not a stick, but like a like a bolt of electricity. And he and and then when he throws it on you, I think it's like a little like a bolt of electricity hits your body. Like it kind of like shocks you basically. Like that's what I think it is. Let me know if I'm also wrong about that one too. You know. But in Law's Awakening, I'm gonna keep it a buck fifty. Law's Awakening, I do not know, but Law's Awakening could be. This is just this is th at this point this is this is just my thoughts here. I think Law's Awakening is gonna be an awakening where he heals. I don't know why. I just feel it. But I could be wrong actually. Having an ability that could heal on its own is 
kind of overpowered. And Awakening, too. But, yeah, I don't think that's going to be the case. But, yeah, I, I can't to, I'm, I can't to keep this video short and very short. But, yeah, that's what I think That's what I think Lost Ultimates are going to be. Let me know down below if you guys actually think it's going to be like that or you guys think it's going to be a whole different shit. And, yeah, I guess we're done here. So, I guess I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace. Enjoy the rest of your day. And Lost should be coming out in December around there. So, yeah. Peace, boys.